about our mass drive. It'll be the week of May 11th. There'll be a box in front of the Welcome Center that you can drop your masks off on either Monday, May 11th, or Wednesday, May 13th. Today we are going to be making some homemade masks. These are great. Yeah, so you're going to start with a big piece like that, and then you're going to fold it in. Now you're just gonna take it and pin one edge down. Then you're gonna sew that. You'll see that here, and when you're sewing, you wanna make sure you re keep readjusting so it's super straight. Now if you don't have a sewing machine, you can always use hot glue, just the sewing machine works a lot better and it makes it a lot sturdier, but anything you can do will help. Also, if you have thinner fabric, I suggest folding it over a few times and then doing this. So, then it'll... This is how we make the straps. I cut a t-shirt and then I'm going to cut all the way along and then I'll cut it again. And then here it is. You're going to place it down on one side and fold it over with equal lengths on either side. And then I suggest pinning one side down again just to make it an easier sew. Um, and then you're gonna sew it, keeping it straight. Make sure the two strings are hanging down on either side and do not get sewn because that can screw up the entire thing. See that? And then once you get a pretty sturdy line and everything is kind of conjoined, you can take the pin out because it no longer serves a purpose and it'll mess up the sew if you continue to sew with it. Cool. And you're gonna pull it out, cut the string, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. Okay, now you're gonna take it and fold in the edges like that and then fold it back up. Now once you do that, you're gonna pin in one side and then sew that side again. This will make it super sturdy and those are gonna be the ear straps that go around your ears. Since the string I used was um, is very stretchy, I like to get it very close to the edge of the mask so then it won't fall off and be too long. But if you're using something like a shoelace maybe or a ribbon, I suggest making it a little bit longer so then you can so then it fits around your face. You can also use two strings if you want instead of just that one long one, but that could be more work and you don't want to. If you're just trying to make the masks, it's the same thing, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, now I have your final product mask and I'm just gonna here show you snipping off all of the loose strings that did not go in that were on the edge. And like I said again, you can always use hot glue because if you don't have a sewing machine and now is there's the modeling it, it fits great. You see the nice ear strap. 